Well, it's been a little while since my last video, and I meant to do it more in steps and stages, but I ended up getting a handful of stuff all, all in a short period of time, so I'll cover that. Um, uh, my five-tier floating corner shelf here um, was a nice, a nice thing I'm, I'm glad I got that uh, I'm really happy with. I'm really happy with it. Let me back up a bit here. I think it looks really good. Uh, and I'm, I'm going to just continuously get some cool stuff. Uh, these are some of my first little things I had to get. Of course, I'm a Godzilla nerd. I have to get the... Uh, I got a Mecha Godzilla. And um, I, you have to add just a little bit of, like, sexy to, the, to a man cave, right? Um, at least in my mind... There, in, somewhere in my mind, there's a, an, un, a, a, an unknown quantity of sexiness you have to have. Uh, you know, in my mind, you don't want to go too far uh, or too little. You know, I, I have a balance somewhere. But here's my uh, ReZero Rem Ram. Uh, I'm thinking about getting more. Uh, thinking about getting another uh, Rem and putting it up there. Yeah. Um, I might even do the same with more Godzilla stuff because I, you know, I can fit a couple things on each shelf, you know, pack it. Like just fill it full on each shelf. Uh, I got some other things coming uh, to fill that up. But uh, next up is the uh, blinds that I'm really happy with. These are zebra blinds. Um, and I got one for each window and, I, and I'm really happy with them. They, they uh, look great. Uh, these are cordless, so you just um, push up and down. But this is what this is the, the result you get. Uh, so you know it's uh, you can either have a little bit of light in or have them like that if you want. Close them. I love them. Uh, I like to have them closed, <laughs> but they look great. They do. Uh, they're not like total blackout curtains, as you can see, but, uh, you know, that's fine. I mean, um, it really keeps the place dark uh, if I turn off the light. Uh, yeah, so there's no problem, even in direct sunlight, which that side of my house gets. Uh, I just have to keep my cats away. They want to get up and play with them, uh, especially this one that they can reach from my desk. Uh, also, I think lastly is, um, this is an i5, an old refurbished i5 I got from, uh, Tiger Direct. So, uh, I can't remember all the specs. And it's, it's in quite a, you know, kind of a semi-compact package. Uh, but it just came with like, uh, like I said, i5, I think 1.2 gigahertz. Uh, that's 256 gigabyte drive, but I'm going to get a, a larger terabyte drive put in there. Um, and I'm loading in some, uh, like arcade emulator stuff in there. So one is called Launchbox. Um, it's like a front end. It's like an arcade emulator front end. But that, that about does it. Uh, so that's this video. And of course, just as a recap, this is the, the first thing I put up was the um, Godzilla disc plates. Um, so it's actually starting to, starting to look a little bit different now, you know, We're just getting the first stages of, of the place looking a little different. Uh, it's, it, it's slowly but surely taking shape. And there, I, now I might move the RGB lamp. I don't know if I'm going to keep it in that corner or not. Uh, so I'm gonna, I still have to take a lot of this stuff out. Uh, this, one of the next things I'm thinking about doing is, is removing the desk. I'm getting a new desk. Uh, part of it is just like what order do I want to do things in. And I'm kind of just flying by the seat of my pants with it all. So I might do, I might go ahead and, and just get in the desk in next. Or I might do something else. I don't know. I have a couple more things coming. I have a really cool little DIY idea that I'm going to do uh, on this floating shelf. And 
fingers crossed uh, it ends up looking cool but I might even have a video as soon as tonight or tomorrow uh, to show you that all right that's it that's current progress on the on the man cave